Hi, welcome to Atim's Drum Spot lesson. My name is Atim. Today I'll be taking on rudiments, starting with the roll rudiment for beginners. So today I'll be talking about single stroke roll and double stroke roll, which is the simplest rudiment that you can play on your drum set. Basically, for every beat you play, it is the single stroke rule. So today, we will try as much as possible to see how we can use the single stroke rule and apply as a feel on a basic beat. And then we'll also see how we can use the double stroke rule as a feel with a basic beat for beginners. So, what is a single stroke rule? A single stroke rule is just alternating between your right hand and your left hand, which I'm going to demonstrate for you. A single stroke rule is played like this. Your right, your left hand, right, left, right, left. When we advance, from this lecture, I will show you in a notation how you can apply the single stroke rule in a whole beat, a half beat, an 8 beat, 16 beat, and 30 second beat. Okay, so for the single stroke rule, That is basically your single stroke rule. So we'll take a beat and then we'll see how we can apply this single stroke rule as a feel to the beat that we're going to play. So let's say we take a beat and we apply. Now that was a single stroke roll with a basic beat using as a feel in a drum a beat. Now don't be too stuck up in playing randomly like I just played. Try to find your sound in playing between your snare drum and your floor tom, or your snare drum and your cymbal, or your snare drum either with your high tom or your mid tom. For example, So what makes your drum very unique is how you'll be able to combine between this, each of these drums and then make a rhythm or make a unique pattern on your play. Using this single beat will really help you to understand your drums, the relation between your snare drum, your thumb drum, and your cymbals, and your hi-hat. So, Single stroke rule is the most easiest of the rule rudiment. And including your bass drum, you also use a single stroke, uh, single stroke rule or a single beat. If you're playing a beat, it will always come as one beat. When we go into double stroke rule, I will also show you how you can use the technique for double stroke roll on your kick. But for now, let's stick on to the single stroke roll and then see how we can also use the metronome to play as a beginner. Now, it is a very good practice 
when you begin to play for the first time, want to be a, a good drummer, try every time as much as possible to play with your metronome. Starting from 60 BPM to 80 BPM to 90 to 100 and to 120. I'm going to demonstrate how you can use the, the, the metronome as a guide to play your basic beat and your feel. Now, depending on how smart you are, if the 60 BPM is too fast for you, try to reduce it to 30 BPM. I'm going to demonstrate starting with a 60 BPM. So that was the basic beat with a feel using the metronome at 60 BPM. Now when you're comfortable playing with 60 BPM, you can now increase your tempo from 60 to 70 to 80 to 90, 100 and 120, depending on your capability. But you have to be accurate on your metronome. Don't just rush to playing fast. It is a good practice, you use your metronome, but don't be faster and don't be slower. You'll have to play in time, okay? So I'm gonna to try to play 100 BPM with that same basic beat. with a feel using 100 BPM. So you can see as you progress with the tempo, so as your playing also improves. So in the next class, I'll introduce you to double stroke roll. See you in the next class.